Yo guys, welcome to my Trails of Cold Steel 3 side quest guide, Geofront F Sector Monster. So to start this quest, you want to put on some gear that will make you immune to seal. And uh, if you want, you can do stuff that's immune to burn as well, because he will put a burn on you. So once you're ready, we are going to head to the Crossbow City Station and go to the Geo Front Sector Interior. And there's going to be a charging station to the side if you need it. But if you don't, the boss will be right up here. So this boss is pretty easy as I long as powerful... things go right, I guess. I so to start off, you want to use Alyssa's it's my turn. Uh, Brave Rush thing to make it so the stagger meter takes more damage and then we want to focus on staggering the boss so you want to use flame bridge with Alyssa crescent slash with reen and with machias you want to use mail breaker and then emma you want to use uh vorpal flare those will give the most damage to the stagger meter so he's going to run around like crazy. If we don't burn him down quick, he can actually heal up really fast. So we want to kind of like have this combo work so he doesn't have a chance to heal up. So we're just about getting ready to break his break meter. So we do Crescent Slash or Flash or whatever it's called. So his break meter is broken. So now you want to use Machias's. Uh, brave order because it will give you a lot more turns so we're going to focus on just Leave doing combo attacks They're down. so do an assist and that will fill up your uh, brave points or whatever it's, it's called as well so we're just going to keep going until we don't get another turn before him I'm going. so it's pretty simple um, I never had burn damage immunity so if you don't either Take just this. make sure that you don't die to burn because that would suck yes. And don't use Emma's Limit Break either, as it doesn't do any damage. So we're just going to keep going here. So we got Machias. He's going to do his Pierce thing. Emma's going to smack him. And then now, since it's Reen's last turn, we're going to switch to uh, Raging Fire, so we do more damage. And then we're going to do a normal attack with Reen. And then we're going to start channeling some S-Breaks here. And if all goes well, he should be dead after the S-Breaks. If you guys found this video helpful, please hit the like and subscribe button. It'll help the channel out a lot. Thanks for watching, and have yourselves a great day. My blade, calm as still. Everyone okay?